Welcome to the new series, Saving Ourselves. I'm Curtis Sensenig and I'm a climate filmmaker. I'm following the entire process of building the first offshore wind farm in the United States. An offshore wind farm is huge wind turbines built way out in the ocean. I think that eventually the East Coast and maybe the entire world can get a lot of their electricity from offshore wind. The east coast of the U.S. is one of the best places for offshore wind because there's lots and lots of consistent wind and it's a large continental shelf, so the water's a little more shallow and it's easier to build there than in deeper water. Our first trip out is to the area where they're gonna store and organize all the components that they use to build each wind turbine. It's in the New Bedford Marine Terminal in Massachusetts. And there's not a whole lot to see at first, at the beginning of the project. Just some huge cranes and a dirt lot. So the, the ring crane behind me is one of the biggest cranes that is operating in the world today. And it has a 2,300 ton uh, lifting capacity. Turbines are made of three different kinds of components. One is the towers that come up out of the ocean. The other is the middle part called the nacelle, which is essentially the generator. And the third are the blades that attach to the nacelle and spin it. Over the next weeks and months, we filmed all these different turbine components arriving, and we're gonna show you everything. This is just the start of building a whole bunch of these massive offshore wind projects that are really gonna make a step forward in a big way toward solving the climate crisis. So stay tuned.